Welcome to another studio tutorial. In this video, we're going to explore responsive design. Responsive design consists in making websites adapt well to different screen sizes and devices, such as tablet and mobile devices. It's a fundamental part of web design nowadays as more than half of the internet traffic generates from mobile. Unresponsive web design simply shows the same design on any screen size, forcing mobile users to zoom in to read text or to see content on mobile. If a website is responsive, on the other hand, its layout and text size also changes to optimize for each screen size. In this example, we have a responsive design in Studio. And we can view a page in multiple screen sizes in two ways. First, below the top bar, we have a responsive bar. And we can click to view and see what this looks like on the iPad, for example, or on a mobile phone. The second way we can review our responsive design is by clicking and dragging on one of these drag handles near the edge of the web page. And you can see as we expand this web page, we can view the different breakpoints as far as the text resizing. And if we scroll down a little bit, we can also see the top destinations will break down to one column. To make these kind of changes, it's important to design for desktop first. And then as the browser shrinks down, you'll want to make changes in areas that look broken for that smaller screen size. And that's a quick look at how responsive design works in Studio. In the next video, we're going to go into the details of how to make this work.